The country continues to react to these with protests surrounding the death of George Floyd. And now a local community activist gives us his thoughts about how the community should respond. News 8 Now's Tyler Job has a story. You stop and he's breathing right now, bro. You think that's cool? It's still hard to watch the scene that unfolded in Minneapolis last week. Bad number, bro. You think Honestly. that's cool right now, bro? This isn't just one incident. It continues to happen even after we have conversations about fixing it. Like the rest of the country, the death of George Floyd struck a nerve for many in our community as well. Peace! No justice! No peace! I think people at this moment are tired, frustrated, and they want more to happen. Community organizer Shondell Spivey says he supports the protests happening in La Crosse. They're exercising their right to feel and to be seen. George Floyd! George Floyd! And to essentially give voice to an issue that La Crosse oftentimes probably would have been silent about. So far, the protests in La Crosse have been peaceful, but not in cities like Madison and Minneapolis. Spivey says it's easy for people to focus on these violent events, but doesn't think we're addressing police brutality enough. We should be focusing on what solutions can we come to the table with and actively implement so that protest and rioting and looting doesn't have to happen. He says racism is not a one city issue. La Crosse got to wake up just like everybody else in the, this nation. And solutions to racism, he says, start with the city's leaders. It's important for us to look at our neighbors and see respect and not feel fear. In La Crosse, Tyler Job, News 8 Now. Spivey is also the president and founder of Black Leaders Acquiring Collective Knowledge. They're always looking for those wanting to get involved. For more information, just visit their website.